Mommy, remind me again why we have to wear these bracelets. Sweetheart, I told you. It's so the government can make sure that we don't use our superpowers. So I can't even use my superpowers just for a few minutes? No, superpowers have been banned. If you use them, they will take you away. Do you want that? No. Then you must never use your powers. Watch your sister, please. Okay, Mommy. They even gave her a bracelet, but we don't get our powers until we turn five. Peekaboo! How are you doing that? Powers detected. Sissy, stop! FBI, open up. Please, sir. I'm sorry, ma'am, but you know the rules. No using powers. She's gonna have to come with us. No, not my baby. You let her go! You better stand down, kid, or you'll be coming with us, too. No! Hey, you, freeze. Give me your purse. You don't scare us. My dad here has super strength and is bulletproof. Oh, really? Well, I wasn't talking to him. I was talking to you. How about I blow a hole right through your- Honey, you can't use your superpowers. He's right. But, Dad- It's not worth it. I already lost one daughter. I won't lose you. Yeah, you don't want the government to take you. Now give me the purse. Yes. Later, soups. <laughs> Girl, I think I found a way to disable our bracelets. You did? Yeah. Shh. Let me see your wrist. Are you sure about this? Yeah, totally. We can't keep living without using our superpowers. You know what, you're right. Do it. Okay, done. Think it worked? There's only one way to find out. I'm gonna use a power I haven't used in a while. Powers detected. Tricked ya. What? Remember, girls, no using your powers at school. Don't worry, Professor. I'll make sure everything goes fine. I'm so excited for our first day of high school. Yeah, because being stuck in a building for eight hours is going to be so much fun. Everyone, please welcome our new students, Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup. Um, who picked out your names? <laughs> <laughs> the professor named us. Who? Oh, she means our dad. He's a scientist. Oh, wow, very interesting. What a bunch of freaks. <laughs> Way to keep our cover bubbles. Sorry. It's okay, Bubbles. So, you three are sisters? Yeah, why? How come you guys look nothing alike? We're all adopted. Yikes, so you're not really sisters then? Of course we are. Of course we are. Ugh, your voice is so annoying. Why don't you say that again? <gasps> what the? I'm telling you, we saw her. Her eyes were red. I think you guys have seen too many scary movies. I agree. Yeah, me have laser eyes. Come on. We're telling the truth. They are freaks. Ladies, that is enough. You two have detention for lying. What? We are so getting you back. Thanks for trying to protect me, Blossom. Of course, nobody bullies my sister. Blossom, do you realize what you've done? Our cover is officially blown. No, it's not. The principal didn't even believe them. But Blossom, look, there's a camera up there. Uh-oh, do you think they could have recorded me using my... Let's hope not. Don't worry, I'll just destroy the camera. Bubbles, no! Don't! <laughs> what? Now the camera's destroyed. Uh-oh. So there was a fire at school today, hmm? You girls wouldn't have anything to do with that, now would you? You need a job, girl. Yeah, I know. I only have $20 in my account. You know that nanny app? Yeah. Apparently, some billionaire is looking for a nanny. Let me see. He's kind of cute. It says he wants them to be CPR certified, have five years of experience with working with kids, and a college degree. All things I don't have. But he doesn't know that. Stacy, no, we are not faking documents. You need money, honey. <laughs> don't. Don't give me that look. Wow, this is amazing. Your resume is just outstanding. Thank you. When can you start? Oh, I'm free to start whenever you like. <laughs> All right, okay, here you go. I'm gonna give you your first paycheck right now. I got two other kids right there. Say hi, girls. This is your new nanny. Hi. Can she cook? Oh, well, actually... Yeah, her resume says she can cook anything. Since you're a chef, can you make a sushi? Yeah, whatever you girls want. Yay. Yes! Hi, I just want to order some sushi, but I need it delivered out back. <laughs> Don't you dare snitch on me. Mmm, this is so good. Well, I'm glad you like it. Daddy used to cook for us, but now he's too busy with his job. Yeah. You know, what is your dad's job anyway? <coughs> We're not allowed to say. Who made this? Oh, that would be me. Hi, I'm the new nanny. And who are you? I'm Darren's girlfriend, and I'm allergic to sushi. Throw this away. Just go in the other room. It's not bothering you. Ow! Hey! <sighs>
It's fine, honey. Darren gave me permission to discipline the girls. Are you okay? I have to tell your dad about that. Don't bother. He, he won't believe you. She acts different around him. Excuse me, sir. Lucy, hey. This is for you for being so great today. Now if you'll excuse me- Is that a gun? Is that a gun? Oh, you weren't supposed to see that. <laughs> Why do you have that? What is your job? Listen, Lucy, if you're gonna work for me, there's some questions that are off limits, and that's one of them. Excuse me? No, I want to know that I'm safe here. You are very safe with me, Lucy. I promise. Actually, sir, I came up here to talk to you about your girlfriend. What about me? Hey, babe. Hey, baby. Yeah, what about her? I was just gonna say that she's gorgeous. Darren already knows that. Don't you, babe? He didn't listen, did he? No, not really. I told you. Listen, girls, don't worry. I'm gonna find a way to expose her. No, baby. He's just a job. You're the one that I love. We'll talk later, okay? Bye. Lucy, you didn't hear anything. Oh, but I did. No, you didn't. That's a lot of money, huh? It can all be yours. If you keep your mouth shut. Don't tell Darren about my man, and the money's yours. You have a deal. Perfect. And then the fairy lived happily ever after. The end. Thank you for reading the book. I always wanted my mommy to read it. May I ask what happened to your real mommy? I don't know my real mommy or daddy. We were all in foster care before this, but Darren adopted us. But I love you, Lucy, because you're like a real mommy to me. Yeah. I love you girls, too. Then tell him I'm gonna make him an offer he can't refuse. And you better give me my money by tonight. Does this guy work for the Mafia or something? Hey, Lucy. Oh, I, I got it. it. Uh. <laughs> you know, you got really nice- Hey, babe, guess what? Your nanny is a fake. The college she graduated from doesn't exist. I can explain. I don't like liars, Lucy. She lied about everything on her resume. Pack your stuff right now and get out. I told you to go. She needs to be fed. I can take care of that. Sir, please don't fire me. I know I shouldn't have lied about my resume, but I do care about your girls. And if you fire me, they're going to be heartbroken. The kids will be fine, Lucy. Well, then you should know that your girlfriend is cheating on you. What are you talking about? She's lying. I heard her on the phone in the closet. She paid me not to say anything. I did not. You lied to me once, you're probably lying to me again. But sir- You're fired, hun. Get over it. Give me the baby. No. Lucy. Shh, it's okay. Lucy, where are you going? I'm so sorry. I'll be taking that money back. <laughs> It'll be okay? No, it's not gonna be okay. I failed them. Ugh, his girlfriend is so evil. No, baby, he's just a job. You're the one that I love. I think she's out to get his money. Huh? The kids are in danger. I have to go help them. Where's Daddy? Sorry, honey, but Daddy's getting interrogated right now. <laughs> I have to get in there. Hey, where do you think you're going? Hey, boss, look who I found. Well, well. <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Yes, girls, stop struggling. Everything will be fine. For me. Actually, no, it's not. Because I may not be a chef or have graduated from college. But there's one thing that I didn't put on my resume that's uh, about to come in real handy right now. And what's that? Whoa. Whoa. How did you- I'm a black belt in Taekwondo, bitch. Lucy. Girls. <coughs> it's okay. Lucy, is everyone alright? Yeah, Lucy saved us. You're hurt. I'm fine. Thank you. Daddy. Does this mean that Lucy can stay? Yeah, I just hope she can forgive me for being so. Now they have to get married. Yeah, or at least give her a raise, Dad. <laughs> Maybe I'll do both. Happy, Happy birthday, we got you something. I think I know what it is. An iPhone for color pencils. pencils. Really? Honey, they're, they're magic pencils. pencils. Right. Class, write this down. Purple power unlocked. Hey babe, do you mind if we take a rain check on our date this week? Are you nervous? <laughs> what? No, of course not. Are you hiding something from me? Crap, I can't do this anymore. I cheated on you, okay? I'm sorry. I feel so bad you and your boyfriend broke up. This tells me people's emotions. You're not sad. I don't know what you're talking about. She was jealous of us. I knew it. Hey, um, where's mom? She's outside with Coco giving her a lecture about listening. 
Coco, when mommy says stop, you say okay. But she's a baby. Mom, you might not want to talk to her right now. But you still have to say okay, mom. I think she's a baby. I think today I'm going to go with red. Red power unlocked. I get to see people's ages. Well, this will be interesting. Hey, good morning, girly. You're 20? What? How did you find out? Never mind that. But why are you still in high school? I failed. I got held back. Hey, it's okay. Your secret is safe with me. Hey, I'm new. Is it cool if I sit here? Yeah, of course. Thanks. So, how old are you? Me? Oh, uh, I just turned 17 about like uh, two months ago. Psst, hey, what? Do you believe in vampires? No. Why? Because I think I'm sitting next to one. Huh? You're funny. I'm telling you, he's a hundred years old. Can you watch my bag? I gotta use the restroom. Yeah, sure. See, he's- Girl, what are you doing? Looking for evidence. Ew, what is that? I think this is- What the hell, dude? What are you doing with my stuff? What are you doing with my stuff? Well, I think the better question is, what are you doing with this? That's for my lunch. It's strawberry jam. Oh! <laughs> Can I have my stuff back? Yeah, sorry. Yesterday's power was kind of a disaster, so today I think I'm gonna go with green. Green power unlocked. Let's hope this power helps me figure out if that guy is a vampire or not. Hey, so I just wanted to apologize about yesterday. You're good. I actually think you're kind of cute. <laughs> How old did you say you were again? 17. I'm throwing a party tonight. Wanna come? Yeah, sure. I would love that. Sweet. I'll air drop you my address. Hey, you made it! Yeah, but where is everyone? They're on their way. Hey, Mom, this is the girl I was telling you about. Ooh, she looks beautifully delicious. Stop it. Really, I could just eat you. Oh no. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait! I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencils' power? I have to. Wish mode activated. There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you could understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great vampire. Try my punch, darling. The flavor is to die for. Get back. I'm leaving. Wait. I have two vampires after me. This calls for some extreme powers. What would happen if I just picked all of them? Are you sure you want to combine all the pencils' power? I have to. Wish mode activated. There you are. Please, don't be scared. I know you know I'm a vampire, and I'm sorry about lying about the party. Your mom was trying to kill me. I was just trying to hang out with you alone. I didn't realize she was going to act like that. She has bloodlust. I wish you were a vampire so you could understand. Wish granted. What just happened? I think you just turned me into a vampire. How is that even possible? Because I have a secret too, okay? I have magic colored pencils and I think you just used the last of their power. You don't have to worry about my mom killing you anymore. Thank you, because that makes me feel so much better. Hey, since I did this to you, I promise I'll protect you. I'll teach you how to be a great vampire. It's what my dad would want. You picked the prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine. I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. What? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? <gasps> Hello. We're looking for a girl with a pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. We're looking for a girl with a pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. I don't think that's... The captain wasn't asking. I knew it. I could sense her mark. Take her to the ship, boys. Yes, captain. 
Wait, what? Welcome aboard the ship, the Blue Pearl. Legend says when you attach your soulmate, your mark will disappear. So let's see which one of us gets to marry you. Raise your sword if you think the girl is your soulmate. Alright, make a line. Hello, miss. Let's see if it's me. Ah, but that's all of us. What about him? Father, do you think I could try? I told you to stay below deck. Ignore my son. He's no pirate. Wait, where'd you get that necklace, my father? Captain, doesn't that look just like the one that the Pirate King had? Tell me, what is your father's name? You know what? I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost Pirate Princess. I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost Pirate Princess. My father was a pirate, but he wasn't a king. Why do you speak of him in past tense? Because he's dead. Who told you that? My mother. I see. So she was the sea witch who took you away. Don't call her that. She said she wanted to protect me from him. No. Your father wanted you to have a royal life. And she wanted you to have a normal one. At least that's what he told me. Wait a minute. You knew my father? Yes. We were great friends. Why don't I take you to him? You would do that? Of course. After all, you are royal blood. Princess, you have to get off the ship. Right now. What? Why? Because my father lied to you. He's not taking you to see your father, him, and all the other crewmates. They're cursed. The only way to break the curse is to sacrifice a royal. He wants to kill me. I want to help you, but we have to jump off the ship. Your mark, it's gone. That means I'm your... Well, soulmates. I don't even know your name. Oh, right. My name is William. I have a canoe we can escape. Not so fast. You take my son. I'll take the girl. No! William... Where are we? We're on Skull Island, Princess. In the exact spot we were all cursed. How much of my blood do you need? To break the curse, we need all of it. Father, no! You stay away from my daughter. Dad? I told you he was alive. Take all of his crewmates into custody. Turn around. Wait, I was trying to help her! No, wait. Spare him, please. That's my soulmate. Gods, leave him. Yes, Your Majesty. Dad, I thought that you were dead. How did you find me? I gave you that necklace for a reason, Mom. It's a trap. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? Mom, what's this location thingy? Honey, that means you're the special one of the family. Huh? One family member from each household is given the gift of knowing people's locations. Sweet. Cool, sis. Makes up for the fact that you've got no other talent. <laughs> Your brother isn't answering his phone. Where's my brother? He's at Jessica's, and I think we probably know what they're both doing. <gasps> oh, he is so grounded. Dad, you're back from your trip early. Uh, yeah, I am. Secret handshake? What? <laughs> Our secret handshake, we always do it when you get back from your trip. Oh, of course! Uh, honey, I'm so sorry. I'm just so tired. I'm gonna go lay down. He would never forget our secret handshake. I might be crazy to ask this, but where's my dad? <gasps> it's him. Hey, you in there? Hi, honey. Oh, hey, Dad. Is your phone ringing? No. Oh, really? Because I'm pretty sure I hear that. Who's calling you? No one. It was just uh, a video that I was watching. Um, anyways, I'm gonna go now. Hello? Penny, hey, listen to me very carefully. Dad? Yes, that man in the house is not me. Get your mom and your brother and get out. Wait, what? There's a lot more to explain, but- Hello? <gasps> come on, come on, pick up. We're sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service at this time. What? Where is my dad? Dinner's ready. Okay, just a minute. Hey, sis, thanks a lot for snitching on me. Come here. Get off of me, what's up? Shh, something very bad has happened, and I need your help. So there's a man pretending to be dad? Yes. And our real dad is in a basement? Yeah. Your dinner is getting cold. Mom, there's something that we need to- Hey, kids, get to the dinner table now. Doesn't the food look good? Um, who made this? Would you believe it? Your father did. Actually, I'm not hungry. Ah, uh, Penny, come on. Well, I'm starving. No, Mom, don't. Mm, this is great. It's a new recipe. Can we be excused? You can, but your brother is still eating. Let him eat in peace, honey. But, Penny, it's fine. Just go upstairs. Hello, Penny. <gasps> Dad! You can cut the act. You know I'm not your father. Your mom and brother are taking a little nap. Where are they? Why don't you ask for yourself? <laughs>
Where's my brother and mom? Where's my mom and brother? Where are you taking them? Who are you? Well, Penny, I'm actually your uncle. What? Didn't your dad ever tell you he had a twin? <laughs> what do you want with us? Your dad owes me a lot of money, and he hasn't been very cooperative, so I decided I needed a little leverage. That's where your family comes into play. Are my mom and brother... They're fine, and they'll stay that way as long as your dad cooperates. And what about me? Someone with your power can be very useful for my line of work. I think I'll keep you. Your dad escaped from my men. Ask where he is. Where's my dad? So, what's it say? It says he's in his car. Well, he's too late. You and I are leaving. I don't think so. Oh! Penny! Hey! Are you okay? Is it really you? Yes, Penny, I swear it's me, honey. I just found your mom and brother. They're alright. You're safe now. Babe, I got- Don't you dare use any more of those words. Understand? Five million words? That's ridiculous. You won't be using any of those. I'm... What did I tell you about talking? I'm breaking up with you. Oh, really? Where are you gonna go? You don't have any money. Nine million words this year, huh? No one needs that many. Hey, I need you to go to the store for me. I don't like that pink shirt you bought yesterday. I want you to return it. You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. Hi, what would you like to return? Just that? Okay, hold on one second. That'll be $6.99 back on the card. Please help me. Please help me. Oh, uh, did you need my help finding something in the store, or...? Hey, can we hurry up the line? I'm on my lunch break. I don't got all day. Do you need medical attention? No. Hey, it's okay. Can you wait over there for me, hun, and I'll get someone to help you? You're allowed to use three words maximum when you go out. Don't be playing games with me this time. I'll be checking your words when you get back. I'm so sorry. The line is really busy right now, but my manager will be over here to help you soon. There you are. You took forever. Did you return the shirt? Good. Let's get out of here. Damn, why do I feel like I'm forgetting to do something? Wait a minute. You were supposed to make dinner tonight. Go on. What? Is dinner ready? Hey, 8,996,000? You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. You used an extra word, and you're gonna tell me why. Go on, talk. Explain yourself. It was an accident. I was just telling the cashier thanks. Uh-huh. You sure about that? Yes, I swear. You should really have your dinner. It's getting cold. That's enough talking out of you. Go to sleep. Bed, now. How did you make that chicken? Why? Because, after I ate it, my head is feeling... <sighs> my phone is dead, and his is locked away. I have to get the charger. Please hurry up. Yes. 911, what's your emergency? I need help. Thank you for the information, ma'am. Officers will arrive shortly. You. You thought you could get away with putting something in my food? Your words. Why did you use up so many? Actually, don't speak. I'll mm. find out. You can't outsmart me. <sighs> so step away from the girl. Let's see your hands. Looks like I just did. No. Ready to see your soulmate letter? One, two... <gasps> what? Cover it up. Does the letter F stand for something that I don't know? Never mind about your letter. We'll just cover it so no one can see it. It's fine. But mom... Don't argue with me on this one. Here, wear this glove for the ball tonight. But if I wear this glove, how is my soulmate ever supposed to find me? He won't. But that's not fair. Why won't you just tell me what's wrong with this letter? Enough questions and complaining. I'm the queen and what I say goes. Now, if I see you take that glove off one time tonight, you will regret it. Care to dance, princess? I don't really feel like dancing. Oh, come on, princess. It's a beautiful night. All you gotta do is take my hand. Ow! My glove's on fire. Whoa, uh, hang on. I got it. No, no, wait! That was weird. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Hey, is that your soulmate letter? Because I think I... No, please don't look at that. But, princess, I... Aspen, where is your glove? Aspen, you're supposed to be wearing your glove. I... It was my fault. Did you burn her glove? It was an accident. You are to never see this boy again. Gods, take her to her room. Yes, your majesty. Here, I got you a new one. What is with all the secrets? What is wrong with this letter, and why couldn't I talk to that guy? Cover that mark, I don't want to look at it. There are some secrets that are meant to be kept. You obviously don't understand that. Oh, and you're grounded for not listening to me. She's still treating me like I'm five years old. This whole thing about my letter is ridiculous. 
Did I do that? I think I did, but how do I make it stop? Do I have powers? I brought you food, princess. And I brought the Soul Mate Handbook. Don't let the queen see you reading it. I won't. Thank you. F stands for fire, which is the power the male soulmate will possess. My gloves on fire. Wait, so he has fire powers and I have ice? Aspen. You've been locked in your room for a while. I just wanted to check on you. Your hand is freezing. Really? I didn't even notice. Mm-hmm. Well, has anything strange happened to you today? No. But actually, Mom, I'm pretty tired, so I'm gonna... Yes, by all means, get your rest. Keep a close eye on her, please. Yes, Your Majesty. Mom? Princess. <gasps> Shh, hey, it's okay. You know me. I'm the guy from the ball. How did you get onto my balcony? This is gonna sound crazy, but I used my fire powers to fly up here, and I think you and I are... Soulmates. I know. I read the Soulmate Handbook, and this F apparently stands for fire, which are your powers, but the only problem is, I think I have ice powers. Whoa, you're kidding. Well, you know what they say. Opposites, Opposites attract. attract. I say we kiss and see what happens. Wait. We should kiss and see what happens. Uh, wait. What's wrong? I don't know. All of a sudden, I just started to not feel good. I know why. Mom? Mm-hmm. How long have you been listening in? Long enough to know your powers have come in. You knew? Why didn't you ever tell me? Because your powers mean you and your soulmate can never be together. You're lying. I am telling the truth. If you kiss him, you will die. No, we're supposed to be together. <laughs> See? Fire and ice don't mix. Get rid of him. No! <laughs> Wait! Let's go, princess. Stop fighting me. There. Those gloves will not be coming off. Princess? Go away. No, please wait. I want to help you. I know how to get those special gloves off. Let me see your hands. Aspen, I escaped. What are you doing? Proving to you that you and I can be together. What are you doing? Proving to you that you and I can be together. Your Highness, I'm not so sure that was a good idea. She's fine. Right, Aspen? Princess? No. Please, Aspen, don't do this to me. I think your powers were too strong for her. She still has a pulse. There has to be something I can do to save her. True love's kiss. It could awaken her. But you'd have to give up your powers. If it means saving her, I'll do it. If you drink this potion, your fire powers will be gone forever. Please work. Princess! Princess! I can't believe you sacrificed your powers for me. Aspen, you're more important to me than any of my powers could be. Aspen, I was wrong. I had no idea your soulmate was so selfless. Please forgive me. Okay, Mom, I forgive you, but you have to promise me no more secrets. Yes, I promise you. Hey, our soulmate letters are gone. I wonder what that means. Alright, girls, on the count of three, reveal your symbols to me. One, two... Three. I got a heart. I got a diamond. I got a star. What did you say, Denise? I said I got a star. <gasps> what? Mom, isn't that symbol the same one that... Cover that up. What? But why would I need to... Don't question me. Just do it. Aunt Cora, I covered it up, see? Good. Now if anyone is to ask you about your symbol, you'll simply say you didn't get one. Do you understand? I feel so bad you didn't get a symbol. It's fine. Don't worry about me. Well, I found out Jake and I both have a circle. Oh, really? Uh-huh. I'm gonna go show him. Yeah, go ahead. Movie star Caleb Woods reveals a symbol. Take a look. Caleb, show us your symbol. Guys, come on. I got somewhere to be. Please. Oh, come on. All right. It's a star, okay? Is that the mail? Uh, yeah. <gasps> Give it to me. This is it! I want to open it! No, I got it first! Girls, please, at least try to act civilized. <gasps> we won! Oh my gosh, we did! Let me see that. We are pleased to inform you that your whole family has been invited to a once-in-a-lifetime movie premiere. Do you know what this means? You two are going to have a chance to hook up with a big-time movie star. This is crazy! <laughs> oh my god! I call dibs on Caleb Woods. Wait, he's gonna be there? Of course he's gonna be there! He's the star of the movie, you idiot! We have no time to waste. We have to get you two some outfits. What about me? It said everyone in the family was invited. Yes, and last time I checked, you were adopted. But you guys chose to adopt me. Right. Well, that was because in my sister's will, it clearly stated that if anything were to happen to 
her, I were to adopt you. Well, you guys can't just flirt with celebrities. You have to go with the person that has your same... I told you to cover that up. I did, but I took a shower this morning and I guess the makeup must have... Quiet. I don't care about your excuses. Where's our dresses? They're right here. Oh, I'm so excited. Wait a minute, did you guys change your symbols? You changed yours to a star? That's my symbol. Yeah, so what? So what? It's against the rules. I'm gonna turn you guys in. Mom! Put that phone down, Denise. The star is my soulmate symbol. It belongs to- Caleb Woods. I know. That's why you wanted me to cover it up. Let me ask you something, Denise. Do you really think that he would want you? I mean, look at you. He's a big time movie star and you're a high school dropout. You made me drop out of school because you said I needed to focus more on the chores. Yes, but I pay you for everything that you do. But if you disobey me... Ow. Mark my words, you'll end up on the streets because trust me, no one is going to hire you. Girls, the limo's here. Hey, guess who's back from her beauty pageant contest? Maya, how did you get in here? The back door was open. I figured I'd surprise you. What's wrong? Nothing. I'm fine, really. So you do have a symbol! What? No, I... Girl, listen. I don't know what your crazy aunt of yours did to you while I was away, but you need to tell me everything. Maya... Come on, Denise. I want to help you. Oh, no, she didn't. You deserve to go to that premiere and meet Caleb. It's too late now anyways. Not necessarily. I have an idea. Okay, Denise, come on out. Oh, my God. I love it. Are you sure it's okay that I borrow all of this? Of course. Oh, and here's your fake VIP badge that I made on Photoshop. I just really hope my aunt and cousins don't recognize me. Hi, excuse me, Caleb? You want my autograph? No, actually, I... I wanted to show you this. You got a star, too. Mr. Woods, is she bothering you? No, not at all. Here, uh, let's go somewhere more private. Glad you came up to me. I haven't talked to a girl like you in a long time. What about all your fans? Don't get me wrong, I love my fans, but they don't really know me. And my family doesn't even care to know me. Yeah, do you ever feel like your family just uses you so they can get what they want? Even if that means they hurt you in the process? Yep, like nothing I do is ever good enough for them. Yeah, exactly. Wait, you know, I realize I never got your name. Oh, um, my name? It's, um, Caleb, over here! Who's this? They're taking photos of us? Yeah, sorry. Guys, come on, can we get some space?